everyone and good day. Our next project is the most popular technique in making fiberglass products. This is called hand layup or contact molding procedure to make molded chairs, boats, car bodies, and other projects. To make all this, we need the following materials. Gel coat of the isothalic NPG type, CM450 fiberglass mat, Durawax, R10-103 semi-flexible resin and its hardener, paintbrush, aluminum roller, plastic wedge, rubber mallet, and the mold. We begin with this mold for an RC boat, which we are waxing with Durawax. After this is done, we now apply the gel coat using a paintbrush. Make sure that the hardener is mixed well with the gel coat. We now apply the mixture onto the mold, beginning with the first of two coatings. Note that the gel coat is a special resin unlike the regular ones. It has better resistance to UV rays, scratching, and water absorption. Other application methods include the use of a spray gun. After the second coating has been applied and has dried, we now place the fiberglass matte reinforcement. Like most molded products, we will be using R10-103 semi-flexible mixed resin with its hardener. Apply the mixture with a paintbrush, making sure that it is fully absorbed by the fiberglass with no air bubbles visible. Note that mixed resin come straight from its container. The most common mistake is to mix it with excessive amount of styrene monomer. Use an aluminum roller to remove any entrapped air bubbles. Apply enough resin to saturate the fiberglass. Too thick a resin mixture applied can only result in cracks. When the resin mixture and fiberglass hardens to a certain degree, Trim off the edges with a knife or a cutter. After an hour or so, we can remove the hardened product from the mold with the use of a rubber mallet and plastic wedge. Begin by tapping the bottom of the mold with a rubber mallet. The plastic wedge is then inserted between the mold and the product. And this is now the finished product with a smooth, and glossy finish. Mm -hmm. 